have to uh, apologize to everybody that's here, all four of you. I've been drinking. I don't know if you noticed. And, uh, you know, the world is all fucked up, but in here we can unfuck the world. The question is, what if the world wants to be fucked? Why would we stop that? You know, there's no way to win. All we have to do is keep introducing the acts, blowing the bubbles, and making sure that the sound system uh, unfairly uh, discriminates against all the performers. And now, for God's sake, this has been teased for quite some time. The teasing is over. Now we gotta stick it in. Please welcome to the stage, Joe! i been waiting for Joe a long time. Thank you for being here, Joe. I promise to make it sound better than the other acts. No, it's on us, unfortunately. This show has sucked until now. Just kidding, it's been amazing. Joe, thank you for coming. Stick it in. Yep. Yep. Stick it in. I'm forever blowing bubbles. Sing that, Tom. Yep. You playing for a minute? Testing. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. We got a little bit of height there. It's better. That's better. Yeah, I can work with that. I can work with that. You can cut the bubbles back a little bit. Yeah, good. Good, good. Okay. All right. Let's see how it goes. Yeah. Need any adjustments right now? Okay, so I'm not a prima donna that way. That'll work. Let's see. Hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, Joe, give him a round of applause. quick. Honestly, the joke's horrible, but the circumstances, so I'm going to tell you the joke first, and then I'm going to tell you the circumstances under which I learned it. So the joke was super quick. It was like a priest and a rabbi were sitting having dinner, and the priest said, hey, what do you say we go screw a couple of altar boys? And the rabbi said, screw them out of what? <laughs> I know, right? Yeah. The funny part was that I learned this joke three tables away at a crowded family restaurant. That's the funny part to me. It's like, I, I heard it. This dude was telling it three tables away with kids and everything around, but you know, whatever. So. Oh, thanks. Good. So, I don't have any originals in my head. Um, not really Irish. Everybody's a little Irish when they drink, but I got some Dropkick Murphys that, uh, that, that I like, kind of a love song. So, um, and I'll start with that and try not to make it too painful. Uh, did have a grandmother who claimed to be Irish. We think it's French Canadian, but you know she's dead now, so whatever. So anyway, yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna wreck her little story. Score at the bar. 
bona fide blues number. It's a real song. Um, hey, the blood told this one turns out pretty darn good. Yeah, it's about time, right? Oh, okay, so um, this is an old one. I, I think uh, last time I heard it was Lead Belly. I think Kurt Cobain read it a version, but you know, more yeah, about the Lead Belly. Can you hear the wind howl? I 